This is our two bedroom mid terrace on Monkchester. As you can see, you've got a drop curb there. Off street parking. Going to take you into this one. As you can see, the front garden is mainly patterned concrete. Which are mature bushes there. And I'm going to take you right into this nice spacious lounge. So I'm going to walk you straight through. As you can see, we've got a nice big bay window there. Fireplace. Got some of the original features. Obviously got a ceiling rose cove in there. Nice size room. Decor is quite nice. I'm going to take it through in the kitchen. And I'm going to take it to the bottom and spin around. We've got a downstairs cloak room as you can hear the fan going there. So that's the kitchen. I'm going to head into the garden, which is a bit of a treat because it's so fierce and and you're just gonna get blasted with the sun. There we are, it's like Spain. So we've got some mature bushes on the left there. Got some bushes there. It's a bit deceiving this, because it does go quite a way back. And I'm gonna take you there. Obviously I'm gonna spin around, show you the back of the house. There we are. So basically, we've got the shed at the end, which has obviously seen better days, but it shows you that this go further back. Obviously you've got a shed here and you've also got a greenhouse there so it just shows you the depth of it once you start cutting things back a little bit. Looks quite narrow but as you can see from the bottom here it's a lot larger than what it looks. You can imagine just having coffee there on the morning or a glass of wine on the night time and just coffee in the morning. There you are, blasted with the sunshine. Beautiful. It's what everybody wants. So we're going to be heading upstairs. As you can see, the property does need a little bit of work, but um, some of the rooms are absolutely fantastic. I'm going to show you this walk-in shower, which hasn't been done that, that long ago. It's very modern looking. As you can see, we've got a walk-in shower here. Complemented, obviously, with the cloakroom downstairs. So, you know, you've got your, everything you need here. Nicely done. Obviously, safety floor in there. So I'm going to take in the master first. Bedroom number one, which is obviously the larger room. This lies to the front of the property. Nice big window there, sliding door wardrobes, nice big room, and last but not least is bedroom number two, which is very tastefully done, I think this has just been decorated not so long ago, got all the flat flooring, this obviously lies to the rear, what a beautiful garden out there, it's bedroom number two, which is a good size double. And we will finish it there.